it's Anna here and in front of me as you can see I have a Kiki K package or maybe you can't see it's actually the new like Christmas packaging it looks like even though Christmas is over this is actually my Black Friday order from Kiki K it's taken quite a while to get here I mean everything with the post office and stuff and shipping takes longer during the holidays which was definitely the case for this one either way luckily I didn't really buy anything for Christmas otherwise that would have been a fail it is I guess Christmas gift to myself <laughs> some things that I've been wanting for a while that I finally decided to pick up so let's just open and finally get to see them with my own eyes okay here we go all right so we have the regular card here and okay so this first one I think I'm gonna take this one because this one is actually Christmas themed, I believe, if it is what I remember. Some things I barely even remember ordering. Uh, I can't remember everything I ordered. <laughs> I just know that it was a 30% off store wide. So this is something, when I first saw it on the website, I just knew I had to get it because it was so cute. <gasps> All right, so it is this gorgeous gingerbread man, or gingerbread man, <laughs> oh man, it's multiple, so man. Um, porcelain cup and oh i don't want that <laughs> and it's so cute it's just like a creamy white color and some of them are foiled like a rose gold foiling and some of them have like been bitten out of and they have super cute little faces i just love this one so much i just knew i had to get it it's so cute it's my first kiki k mug i think i usually don't get their mugs um but i know like my friend desley she collects them which i really i can see why because they're gorgeous let's see this one because of the foiling it's not microwave safe and there's only hand washing so that's it's not a very practical mug um but <laughs> it's cute and I'll only use it during the holidays probably anyway. So yeah, but I'm so happy to finally have it. So next up in this big bag is something I completely forgot that I ordered. <laughs> it's a paper lover's book apparently and it looks to be, oh, okay now I see why. <laughs> I see why I ordered this one. There's a bit, little bit of a theme with my order. I'll get to that. So this is the People Hours book with the, I think the newest cute collection or Be Kind or whatever they call it, combined with this one. So they've done it this now that you just flip and it's two different ones. Quite interesting. Um, this is the collection I think I really wanted, but I'll flip through this one too. So this is really cute pastels. Um, I think you can do some really fun stuff with this. Look at that hot dog. <laughs> um, I'll just flip through this really quick. Uh, I'm sure there's more detailed flip throughs on YouTube already. I mean, I know there is because like Plum Mashable, I think has, oh, these are really, these are like nice hollow foils. I really like that. <laughs> um, I think I watched hers, really nice tags, all kinds of stuff. This collection is like really good for someone who likes pastel and like happy colors and things. Ooh, hollow. Uh, letters that's nice i want to use these type of sticker letter stickers more because i don't really like my handwriting and i want to be able to uh, spell things out nicely anyway so there's a bunch of paper crafts in here a bunch Ooh! oh kindness cards oh i like this idea that's really nice and then there's wrapping paper in the middle this time let's see what the other side is of this one. Oh, okay there we go yep and then we have, on the flip side, I guess I'll go from this side then. It is the Woodland Wonders, or Wonders? I think it's Wonders, Woodland Wonders collection. Um, I love this collection so much, and this is the reason why I picked up um, this Paper Lovers book. Because I wanted to have more of this collection in my life. And you'll see soon that I bought quite some more from this collection there's a bunch of really cute like puns like animal and forest puns and all the pastels um i love this collection so much actually because it really reminds me of home like all the different uh, illustrations feel very swedish for me i'm from sweden live in sweden if you didn't know um and i don't know they just I don't know yeah they really remind me of home and plus all the colors i love so much because they're soft and nice um 
so that's why I think I love this collection so much. I love these bookmarks. I think that's one of the reasons I really wanted to get this one because I'm reading a lot of books at the moment um, and I have a goal for next year to read a lot of books. <laughs> so um, it's good to have some more cute bookmarks to keep me inspired to read. Oh, some quote cool cards. I love that. And then we have here the wrapping paper. So cute. I'm happy to have more of that collection. And yeah, a new paper lovers book. I haven't bought one of these in a long time actually from Kiki K. So that's really nice. All right, so next up are some more things from the Woodland Wanders collection. It's the embroidered paper clips. I think, I mean, I love paper clips as you probably know if you watched my like planner setups and stuff. Um, but these are really cute. So there's a little acorn, a little hedgehog, a little mushroom, a bike, um, a squirrel and a little deer. And I love the pink. I love the soft pinks in this collection and the mint. It's just really my colors. But then there's some like pops of like the brown and the red. Uh, they mix kind of soft and more bright colors. But I just love this collection so much. And like I said, the illustrations and style it feels very home for me. Something I forgot that I ordered, but <laughs> are these. And I'm actually really uh, glad that I did because recently, I don't know why I haven't realized it before, but there are like two types of, as I would say, collectible Kiki K pens. So I've been kind of collecting the, um, what's it called, slim ballpoint pens, which are obviously ballpoint, but I don't really like ballpoint that much. I actually much more prefer gel ink pens. And Kiki K have their everyday gel pens, which are this style that has the uh, clip on top. Oh, what's going on here? Oh. Okay, <laughs> so it would be kind of obvious for me to like these ones a lot more. So since I love this collection so much, I decided to pick up the every Everyday Gel Pens with this design. So we have a mushroom one, have a really pretty teal and rose gold foiled one, and we have the like main pattern that also is on the Paper Lovers book here, which I love so much. I actually have a journal uh, in this color. That's the first item I got in this collection and I love it so much and now I want all of it pretty much. It's not, it's not very good, but yeah. <laughs> so it is a gel pen. It is not ballpoint. Uh, I'm gonna see if I have something yeah, I can scribble on. So there's black gel ink that I really like um, and I prefer much more than ballpoint. So I'm probably gonna try to pick up these if I'm buying pens from Kiki K in the future. And then we have the thing that I am most, most absolutely excited about. It is another planner. And I know I have way too many planners already, but it is in a size that I've come to love a lot recently. It is a personal size planner and it is also the one from the Woodland Wonders collection. And this one, ah, oh, it's, it's quite unique for me. It's a brown planner, as you can see, which is my first one. Um, <laughs> I usually go for a lot more like colorful, either pastel colors or like brighter colors. I usually don't go for neutrals, but you open it up, you see it's not just neutral because there's actually a mint lining that I really love a lot. And also something really unique with this pen, it has rose gold rings. That is really cool, I think. It's the first KK, actually first planner of any kind I get that um, has rose gold rings and I've wanted one for a while. Either way, I'm gonna flip through this one with you and see all right, so we have, as usual, a notepad here. This one says small notes and it has lines. We have the two pockets that are standard on a Kiki K and a secretarial, secretarial pocket right here. The gorgeous rose gold rings I love so much. Then we have the dividers. Uh, these are so cute. Love the little things. This one says, oh, and it's like a blush pink on the back. Oh, so cute. Then we have the label stickers for the tabs. Some decorative stickers. I love that. Then we have, uh, oh, that's a really nice quote. Um, we have, what's it called? Um, <laughs> the monthly view. Um, then we have weekly view. Oh, sorry, what was this one? Yeah, this divider was different, yeah. The weekly view, lots of those. Then we have, I love that all of these are unlabeled. Um, 
even the first two ones. So you can label however you want and mix around the inserts. I love that all the dividers are different. And I love that it's pink on the back. It's so cute. We have to do inserts. I love these. I use these actually a lot currently in my um, planner. So I I'm glad to have some more. And then we have some uh, note pages. And I am guessing that the rest are notes. Note inserts, yes. And it's all in this gorgeous, like, tealy color. Um, which actually matches a lot because I use this color a lot. So it, it won't be really hard for me to make this planner work with the type of style that I have. Like, I love pastels um, and stuff. So it won't really be difficult even though it's like brown. <laughs> um, I think that just makes it really neutral, but then when you open it, you can have a bunch of pretty pastels and gorgeousness. And once again, I love the fact that the rings and hardware is rose gold. It also has this new type of snap with two buttons that is lovely. So you can snap it tight or you can snap it a little looser, depending on how much you fill it up. Uh, or if you want it to like, if you snap it closer, it's gonna push here. And now it's a bit more loose so it depends how you want it but i like that you get the option for both this is a i guess this i believe this is a vegan planner and it's a really unique feeling it looks like leather um and it almost looks like suede because it's matte i thought at first it might feel like um soft or almost like fussy <laughs> on the pictures it almost um looked that way but it's soft, it's matte, it's smooth, but it's not fussy. It's not like suede where you can like see the fuss, if you know what I mean. I don't know, for some reason I thought that might be a thing. But it is actually pretty much exactly the same as the Kiki K Dream Life Planner. When I feel them, yeah, it's the same type of, uh, I was about to say fake leather, but like PU leather or whatever you call it. It's not actual leather, it's like synthetic fake leather so it looks like leather but it's not but they feel the same so if you've been wondering what they feel like if you own one or the other you know it's the same and it looks like they would like show different types of wear and tear like you see there's texture to them like the color differs a little bit but this is not my doing i feel like they're made to look that way and i actually like that look when i do this it almost looks like they would change uh, texture or color like you know like suede wood um but it's not suede <laughs> and i get very like it's a very um deceiving look uh these two but i love them and i love the feel it's so nice and it's very unique i don't think ek has ever done planners like this before also since i have them here this is a comparison of the b6 and the personal size if you ever wondered <laughs> you can see the b6 is a lot more square um than the personal one is and a bit wider as you can tell the rings are actually the same size so you're actually able to use personal sized inserts in the b6 uh, but you can't really use b6 inserts in a personal because you can see they're way too wide um, <laughs> so if you ever wondered there's also to clear that up all right guys so that was everything for this video my little mini kiki k haul it doesn't feel so mini because i like bought a whole new planner. I think I'm gonna start using this one for fall. It feels very fall-ish with, um, you know, the brown. But I think I have a Marmalade little bits kit that will fit this one perfectly. And I'm really excited to set it up. I might set up set it up sooner, even though I won't use it for a while because that's how I roll sometimes. I just love setting planners up. Um, but either way, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. And I also hope to see you next time. Bye for now.